hello everyone welcome back to my channel so students let's discuss the passing package for this particular subject that is introduction to electronics and communication it is subject code is BESCK 104 C and 204 C so my dear friends definitely this content will help you in the examination I have taken some important questions from this subject let us discuss without wasting any time so let us start with the model second in which you have to cover uh, most important questions like ideal characteristics of op amp that is operational amplifier parameters right then with need sketch explain the operation of single stage stable oscillator and crystal controlled oscillator and uh, wind bridge oscillator later network oscillator and single stage multi vibrator so among these five definitely one will appear in the examination or, uh, or sometimes uh, uh, among these five two will come in the examination right so um, focus on this single stage stable a stable oscillator and crystal controlled oscillator and sometimes this single stage multi vibrator uh, will al also be asked in the examination part over there then uh, you should uh, know about the uh, difference between the integrator and differentiator or you should have some definitions you should have some concept about these integrator and differentiator which is the most important part as far as this module is concerned right then inverted and non-inverted op amplifiers and uh, write down it, uh, its configurations over there so you have to focus on uh, circuit diagrams and waveforms just draw the neat sketch over there for these type of oscillators you will easily get 10 to 15 marks by covering this much portion over there so this is the content for module second so let's proceed with the uh, module three uh, that is the passing module in this particular subject where you have to cover uh, boolean terms uh, and properties with their truth table this, uh, these are the most important questions and sometimes they will ask if the de morgan's term is the most important one that is the super important question in, in this particular module that is boolean theorem over there and you should write down the truth table that is the most important uh, in the in this particular electronics and communication subject it deals with all about the truth tables right then simplify the expressions questions will be there and uh, subtract using rs complement method these questions will appear in the examination these are the very simple ones you can go through and practice three to four problems from this uh, con uh, content right so i have written here try three to four problems from this type of concept concept that is subtract using rs complement method these are very simple questions you have to go through this is the passing module so you should cover at least 15 marks from this module uh, rest of the things are up to you it is according to your own convenience according to your own potentiality you should go through fully in this model as it is a passing model in this particular subject it is considered as one of the toughest subject in engineering as far as first or second sum is concerned over there so uh, then you have to focus on logic gates right universal gates uh, like uh, and and nor gate or gate like uh, those gates are there which you have, you, you have to ponder over there right then uh, most of the uh, uh, sorry this is the super important question over here that is half adder and full adder you have to go through these two concepts uh, sometimes they will ask half adder and sometimes they will ask full adder so simultaneously both are not asking in the examination uh, point of view over there then number conversion is there so uh, you have to focus on these type of concepts so i have taken uh, seven probability concepts from this module 5 as it is a, sorry module 2 as it is a passing module sorry this is module 3 so this is the passing module over there you have to focus on this then next passing module is module fourth that is embedded systems where you have to focus on block diagram of embedded system and classification of embedded system and applications of embedded system most important question it will come in the first part and elements of embedded system is the most important one and uh, you should go through concepts uh, transducer sensors and actuators then core of the embedded system which i have marked here these are the most important ones right core of the embedded system elements of embedded system block diagram of embedded system and explain how seven segment display can be used to display the data and write and write a brief note on operation of led light emitting diode and differences between mc microcontroller and microprocessor and risc versus cisc right these are the uh, most important questions as far as module 4 is concerned so this is a passing module again my dear friends so module 3 and module 4 are the passing modules in this electronic subject there are a lot of numerical problems also but uh, don't worry you can easily so easily pass this particular subject with the theory itself right so in the module uh, third you have to go through problems so rest of the uh, what we call is modules you don't need to go for the problems if you are convenient if you find some easy problems you can just go through 
and try to cover them right then module first comes up in which you have to cover half wave and full wave rectifier with c filter and waveforms waveforms are most important in this subject right explain how zener diode acts as a voltage regulator negative feedback multi stage amplifiers and voltage double and tripler circuit circuit diagram is important in this particular case over here and uh, if you are convenient with this uh, zener diode you have to go through problems of this particular concept some problems will be asked in the examination in this particular module and what is regulated power supply with neat diagram summarize the working of dc power supply this is the most important one block diagram of this power supply will be there it will appear in the examination over there then voltage multipliers this is another concept you have to you have to go through and explain input and output resistance bandwidth phase shift so this much content is enough to cover the module first all right my dear friends then module 5 comes up in which you have to cover block diagram of communication system advantages of digital communication or analog communication so this is important one this is also an important one and uh, this one uh, explain the diagram concept of radio wave uh, propagation and it uh, and its different types over there this is the most important one and radio signal transmission multi access techniques over there so you have to go through and ask fsk and psk so this much content is enough to cover the module uh, fifth over there and also types of modulation if you go through sometimes video is asking this particular question most important one types of modulation and explain uh, you should have some conceptual uh, what we call as concepts over there on this particular topic that is channels and noise over there then you can write it uh, in your own words in the examination so my dear friends this much content is enough to cover this particular subject that is electronics and communication so most students are struggling in this particular subject so don't worry my dear friends just go through this content you will easily pass this particular subject start now itself otherwise it is too late to start the passing journey for this particular subject so thanks for watching my video